Hello everybody, Ragtag Zagby here. Welcome to the next episode. In this episode, we're finally getting back to story. Huh? This island's is the one with the woods. What about this one? I guess we'll find out when we get there. Uh, Paul or whatever your name is. I still need to learn his name. For, I, I, I'm like, what? 46 episodes in and I still haven't looked up his name. Anyway, we need to go back to Flyer Fro oh, Volcano. After each expedition, you can save your photos. You need to clear level 2 of this place for us to do stories, so let's do that. Scenery! Coming in! We got some adorable shinks things flying around. Flying around? I am an idiot. I meant to say walking around. Anyway, I'm gonna try and get the um This is a uh rare photo. I'm gonna uh, submit that if I can't get the request for this stage. Cause I somewhat remember what I need to do! Anyway. Ah, uh, Marferno. Which I got a really bad Marferno. I don't think any of those photos counted. Got some growl. Alright, play music, I believe, around here. We play our music. Please show up. Hello, Moferno. Ah, uh, the Pokemon ain't showing up. Oh, there they are. Eat the fruit, Archeops. Yeah, we got Altarius flying. Because I was so distracted because the Altarius didn't show up, I also missed out on a four-star photo, which I forget if it's needed for a request. All right. I know I think it's only doable in this level, so I'm gonna have to eventually come back. Cause, ooh, Aerodactyl. Cause this stage is weird. Cause it has multiple requests, but there's like one or two that you can only do in level one, one or two that you can only do in level two, and then the rest you can do in level three. So as you can guess. We're going to be going back to those levels at some point. But anyway, we're going to a new path. Alright, get your camera ready so that way you can slow down a little bit. This one's a little tricky to do. It's sort of a part of a request, but right now I'm just going to do it to get a really awesome shot. We need the Crystal Bloom, the two Charmanders that are in this room. And wait until they're in the center. Once you do that, make Gravilla fall, and you will summon Charizard. It's needed for a four-star photo, uh, a four-star photo. It is needed for a request photo that I can't, well, I can't do the request right now because I don't have it, but I believe the photo is very specific, so I want to get the better four-star, so that way when I get the request later, I don't have to struggle with the request. Hello there, Charmander. Wait, let's hit that crystal bloom there. And everyone will become happy! Even summon a Slugma! Awesome. Slugma! Yeah. 
That's blue ma- I have a question. Has there ever been, like, blue magma in real life? I'm actually curious about that, because if so, that's actually pretty badass. We got sh we got I was about to say shanks. We got Luxray around. Down and we got Typhlosion. And I realize I'm running low on film. Oh my god. Hello there, Typhlosion. Oh, this Charizard. I know Charizard could show up in this room if you wake him up in the previous room. I just thought he shows up even with the Typhlosions here. Burn! It's time to go for the teleporter. So, okay, note to sell. Because I know that if you wait, I know if you summon Charizard in that uh, previous room, he can show up here. It's just I forgot you have to get rid of the Typhosians. Because I know you need to get rid of the Typhosians for a different Pokemon request. Welcome back. Welcome back. Made any new discoveries? Let's submit our Shink photos. Which, I don't think I ever got a good Shink's photo. Now, releasing the Steam is a four-star photo. I took this just in case I didn't get the request photo. Uh, I think you can only do this photo on level two. I'm gonna have to double check. So this may be another reason why we will come back to level two, but anyway. Submit your free star of the Artarias together, because that is a the, the request photo it wants. Okay, that's a two star. I'm surprised I that's a decent two star. At the very least, I got Talifra Tal uh, Talif Talifla I can't even say the Pokemon's name correctly. Let's submit this free star. Uh because even though uh, Typhosion Burning the Apple is a 4 star, there is a much better 4 star later with that we can get and is needed for a request. Okay, Graveler going splat is a 2 star, Graveler rolling away is a 3. Ooh, do I do the do this one star with it doing that pose or I think I'll submit that one. Oh, okay, we jumped to Slugma. Oh, these are all two-star photos. I'll use the one with fire. Uh, okay, that is the four-star. I'm just hoping that still counts as it eating. Because uh, you need the picture of it eating for a request. Okay, that's the best Aerodactyl one-star I got. Okay, that's a free star. That's interesting. That is also... A free what is Charmander doing in that photo that's considered a free? Here we go, Charizard. That is a badass shot. Torkoal! Uh, we could do a better one-star Luxray, but we'll submit that. Submit the ruins, and of course, Morphono's feet was considered a no subject. Now, then. now let's see what we got. A new discovery. Oh, it's Shinx. That's a new one for your photo decks. Nice work. Looks like a friendly stroll. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. And it's a bronze. The more Pokemon you get in the photo, the more insight it gives us into the area's ecosystem. Next, we got Artaria. It's a free star photo. That's new. Nice work. Looks like some friendly humming. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. 
Ah, that's a bronze. Ugh. Well, at least I got the requests. So if I go for this photo again, I can at least get a better Artaria. Free star. Well, that would be a silver at the very least. Now I'm curious about this. There's no way this is going to be a diamond, and I doubt it's going to be a gold. Next is Talonflame, a new one for your photo decks. Perfect timing. Looks like behavior worth studying. Perfect timing, you did wonderfully. That's a diamond?! You count that as a diamond?! First off, Talonflame is nowhere near the center of the flame, and, ha and like half of its wing is cut off in that photo. How is that considered a diamond? Okay, game, whatever you say. A new discovery. Next is Typhosion. A new one for your photo decks. Uh, I wish a f good friend of mine Ein, was watching this because I know he loves Typhosions. Perfect timing. Now you don't see this every day. Perfect timing. You did wonderfully. Throwing fluff fruit or running scans might get the Pokemon to face you. Mm. Next is Graveler. It's a free star photo. That's new. Great timing. It must be in a hurry. Good work. There's no easy shot to get. Mm. Okay, that's a gold. Having other Pokemon in the photo is a nice touch. At least it's a gold. I I can accept that. Next is Monferno. This is a two-star photo. That's new. Nice work. Looks curious. What about, I wonder? Nice work. Keep it up. Remember, getting the whole Pokemon in the frame looking nice and big is a key to a good size score. Mm. Next is Archeops. It's a four-star photo. That's new. I see it's having a nice meal. Perfect timing. You did wonderfully. And request complete, and sweet diamonds. Remember getting the whole Pokemon in frame, looking nice and big is a key to a good size score. Mm. Next is, we got Tarantrum. It's a one star photo, that's nice new. Work. Looks like it's fast asleep, nice going, this isn't a bad shot at all. Nice placement score, your subject's dead center so it all feels balanced. Next, we got Aerodactyl. There's something gallant about it, don't you think? Nice work. I see it's in flight. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Try getting up close to Pokemon's faces too. Mm. Next, we got Charmander. It's a two-star photo. That's new. Nice work. I see it's having a nice meal. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Interesting backgrounds make your shots handier for our research. A new discovery. As a sweet ass Charizard. Next, we got Charizard, a new addition to our research. Nice work. Look at this dramatic entrance. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Yay, you better give me diamonds for that shot. Pokemon you photographed came out nice and big. Well done. A new discovery. Next, we got Tarkoal. This is the first time you got in it as your subject. Perfect timing. Looks happy, doesn't it? Fantastic. You capture it exactly at the right moment. Photographing from different spots might help you get better angles on Pokemon. Next, we got Slugma. It's a two-star photo. That's new. Great timing. Now you don't see this every day. Great timing. This is well taken. Your placement's looking good. Centering your subject balances the photo well. Mm. Next is Luxray. It's a one-star photo. That's new. This is without doubt going to be a bronze. Seems like it's on its way somewhere. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. There are some ancient ruins on Volcania Isle. 
This looks like a clue to the history of the Lenthal region. All the ruins we found date back to roughly the same time period, as far as I can tell. Let's see that research. Oh, we almost leveled it up. Your photos keep getting better and better. I'll make sure our research keeps up with your progress. You discovered a route in the fire flow volcano that leads to the cave of blue lava. You've researched the blue... You, the, you researched the blue magma. You, re, you received the research title Blue Magma. By the way, thanks to your progress you made in your research, I got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. What does the professor have to tell us? Well, you're going to have to find out in the next episode. If you enjoyed this, do like the video. It helps tremendously. Subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure you get that notification running. So that way uh, you can be notified when I upload. And I'll see you in the next episode where we see what the professor has to report. Later.